a potential unified Linux app store. Promote diversity and sustainability in the Linux desktop community by adding payments, donations, and subscriptions to the Flathub app store. In an article from ZDNet, Linux desktop powers consider uniting for an app store. Like all of them uniting? And I thought I drank too much wine. One such problem is how you can install, find, install, and be certain any given program will work on your desktop. Leaders from the GNOME Foundation and KDE Foundation, along with Debian Linux, are considering solving that by building an app store on top of Flatpak. Of course, it is a universal software deployment and package management program. This isn't the first time such an idea has been tried. For example, Linspire, Lindo's pioneered the click and run app store in the mid 2000s. I vaguely remember that. More recently, Elementary OS has been experimenting with a pay what you get app store. But because it is specific to a handful or a single Linux distro, it was never that attractive. Former Google chairman Eric Schmidt's plain text group, that's what I showed you before, the proposal is to promote diversity and sustainability in the Linux desktop community. Excellent idea. Why Flatpak instead of its chief rival Snaps? Flathub is a vendor-neutral service for Linux application developers to build and publish their applications directly to their end users. Canonical, Ubuntu, and Snap's parent company isn't in the least bit fond of Flatpak. Surprise! Flatpak store supporters state, our largest competitor is Canonical Snap Store. Uh, yes, it's under the control of one corporate entity rather than the community-controlled nonprofit requiring copyright assignments for a contribution. So what what's happening here is the Flatpak, I guess, is more uh, neutral. Alas, where would desktop Linux be without fusses over what software is the one true and right software? Probably a lot more successful than it is now. Completely agree. That's why Chromebooks have become the de facto Linux standard for the masses.